welcome to Mexico. We are in Punta Mita on our honeymoon. If you guys um, tuned in for my hometown date when I went to Oahu to see um, where I have lived. Amanda take me around where she's from. I've now brought her to Mexico, which is not where I'm from, but we're on our honeymoon. This is the next episode. Season two. <laughs> um, we are at the new Auberge Hotel. It's called Ciceros. And neither of us have been, wait, have you been to Punta Mita? I have. Okay, well, I haven't been to Punta Mita before. We literally just got here. It's like golden hour. Like taking all of our breath away, so beautiful. It's so beautiful. We have little welcome snacks. We're about to do a welcome shot. I specifically um, brought Amanda with me because I knew she was one of my friends that would like be the perfect balance of like drink with me, but also work out with me in the morning. Oh my God, I love that. I didn't like know some, that. Some of my friends like would like not drink at all. And then other one of my friends would like want to drink too much. Amanda, oh, so you're Amanda saying like perfect, the perfect balance. Perfect balance. <laughs> We have dinner in an hour on the beach for sunset. So I'm gonna show you our room and then we're gonna get ready. Oh, hey, come in. <laughs> Shout out to my travel fit. Are you wearing Elwood? Yeah. Okay, my two favorite sweatsuits right now are my Elwood one, which I didn't wear. And then this one is from Brulee. I've never tried those ones. Um, and then I'm wearing skims underneath it. And like, I'm wearing an aloe top in case anyone wants to. Best try. travel fit. This is our cutie little room. It's so sunny. Honestly, the perfect time to walk into this room. Look at how sunny it is. This window. You guys, look at our freaking bathtub. And then we have this giant bathroom. And we have a giant closet with a poncho. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? Like, this is the bathroom of my dreams because it's called a wet room. And a wet room is just like everything wet. Yeah. Like shower, bath. I'm gonna order tea and then get back and get in the bath tonight. Okay, we're gonna take our welcome shot now, right, Amanda? <laughs> take it. Can you take it now? No, because that takes 30 minutes to kick in. All right, preface like, yes, I'm a good balance, but I need like to plan. Her nickname in Italy was Nona, if you guys remember, if you guys were there for that vlog. Her nickname was Nona, and my nickname was Alora, and I got it tattooed on my neck. Have you. Uh, I haven't shown showed this? them my tattoo. It's my newest tattoo. This is her newest tat. It's I a love neck it. tat. I'm She's a badass a now. <laughs> So badass. <laughs> okay. Okay, Michelle is very excited. How insane is this? Look at it. We're very happy. Happiest girls in the world. We're happiest when it's warm. We have like mango and then like dried mango and tahini and some crudite, margarita mix, and a tiny bottle of tequila with a hat. <laughs> Perfect, perfect, perfect. Sneak peek of the outfit. I'm naked, but we're in Mexico, so. We had a really yummy, very romantic dinner on the beach with a bunch of old people. It was literally us and a bunch of like old couples. It was actually so funny. And we just got back to the room and like washed our faces and put our pajamas on and ordered tea. And then we like get in bed and Amanda <laughs> goes gonna, to plug in her. We well, didn't get it sideways. We're gonna have to just ruin. We're gonna the put the iPhone clips in. The iPhone clip in. Amanda so goes funny. to plug in her phone like there's plugs in our nightstand and she was like, "Do your plugs work?" And I was like, "Yeah." She's like, "Mine aren't working." And we investigate and there's a, the nightstands plug in behind the bed and her nightstand was unplugged, but like the plug is literally in the middle of the wall, like behind the bed, king size bed frame. And I just scooched it out of the way. Wait, but the funniest thing is we realized that the bed frame is still sort of attached to the wall. So she's like literally confusing. pulling it out like the Hulk. And I was like, wait, don't pull it's it. Pilates, you guys look at. Do you see that bicep? No, I was honestly shocked. Like she's got like freak super. I think this one's bigger. There we go. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> You're little... Can you see it? I can't see anything. Wait, hold on. Oh, it's in. It's in. Uh -huh. Okay, wait. Here, give me your hand. This is really cute. 
I can't see anything. I'm blind as a freaking bat. <laughs> you can't tell? <laughs> you can't tell which one is mint? See you in the morning. Good morning. We just woke up and they left our little coffee outside of our door. Look how cute it is. Little coffee basket. <laughs> Worked out, had some juice, coffee, changed for the beach or for the pool, wherever. I think we have a cabana today at the pool. This is my bikini and Amanda's butt. My bikini is from 437. And then I have this little cover up. I actually think it's just from Amazon. So I will find the link. And Amanda's bikini is from PacSun. This is our cabana. Welcome it's our huge. Family. We are feasting. Also, I'm sorry, but sushi by the pool, new favorite thing. Okay, we showered and I'm getting ready for dinner, but like I just need to know, is anyone else a floor makeup girly? Because my makeup just looks better when I do it while I'm sitting. We also need to know. Okay, also Amanda's outfit. No, I think that's so hot. Yeah, but if I wear a thong, is it like too much, you know? Turn around. Oh, you have, are you I naked in the front? I don't think it's too much. I also think you could try putting on like a normal not thong bikini bottom, but I don't think it's too much. I think it's so fucking hot. Where is that dress from? I'm, I'm borrowing it. Okay, so this is my fit. We don't know how we feel about it. Like I feel like something about the fit is off. Like I almost wish I had a string right here. Looks cute together though. <laughs> okay, you guys, I so wish that I had just taken you like outside with us when we tried to shoot those dresses, but we were in kind of a hurry because we wanted to get sunlight. Long story short, we felt so uncomfy because it was just like everyone at this hotel knows us at this point. They like call us by our names and they greet you every single time you see them. And then it's like a bunch of old people and like we were just in the most scandalous dresses. Like, and I was in fucking hot pink and it was just like traumatizing so. You could literally spot Michelle from the other side of the hotel. Literally. Like, it wasn't just like hot pink, it was hot pink with like rhinestones sparkles. and like sparkles. And half my body and exposed. Half, yes, so uncomfy. But anyway, we were so traumatized that we took our photos and we literally ran back to our apartment, tried to avoid all human contact and we changed. And these are our new outfits. <laughs> Dinner as many layers as we could I'm literally like I need to be covered <laughs> pants yeah. yeah this is the back <laughs> They taste exactly the same though. I think they're fucking with us. <laughs> Put some in these G's. They are putting something in these G's. <laughs> Michelle's like high on food, I think. <laughs> oh god. My spoon doesn't even fit in my honey. Oh. oh. <laughs> Our um, bartender man. Did we already tell you this? No, we were on the phone with Jared. Jared. First of all, everyone thinks we're like children. And everyone at this hotel is like old so i'd say they're over at least 45 50. so they think we're like children they think we're like 25 we look young already we're not we're 31 and 32 but yeah he was asking us like if we like to go to like bars or clubs and we were like neither and he was like well then what do you do and then he asked me how many cats i had <laughs> yeah it, honestly it was almost like an interview of life he was like how many languages do you speak yeah then he asked what bad words we could say in the languages but, but he was point, like really appalled that we didn't even like going to like bars. But and then his reasoning for why we should go is he goes, but you guys look so young. And I was like, but literally my mental and soul wants to lay in bed and drink tea. See, if you could only see us now. I feel alive. I'm gonna go to bed now. We're tired. Good night. <laughs>
Good night. See you in the morning. Bye. Good morning, guys. This is my sock sandal combo of the day since I forgot to bring workout shoes. We are going to get a workout in. She's wearing set. Mm. And I'm wearing L Space. This is like one of my favorite sets ever because it's so flattering. That does look good on you. It looks like it might be partly cloudy today, so we're trying to hurry so that we can get some sun before it goes away. And then go lay on the beach before our massages. Bikini today is from Silk Swim. I love their bikinis, they fit so well. And Amanda's bikini is from Lahana Swim. I've only worn green this trip so far. I love it, you're a green girl. You guys, Amanda asked them to move the umbrella so she could have some shade, but they interpreted that as full shade. So now I'm just sitting here with my butt in the sun because I want sun. And I don't want to ask them to move it again because I feel bad because I'm too nice. You also just missed Michelle having a minor freak out about a bug flying in her face. Let me reenact. Nah! <laughs> no, but then two seconds later you did the same thing. I'm drinking my hibiscus marg and I'm happy though. Oh. <laughs> the bug was back. I thought you were going to go. Nah! This is so good. That tastes healthy. <laughs> what a good night, girl. Wait, Amanda got a coconut and now I want a coconut. <laughs> Sushi on the beach. Honestly, might be better than sushi by the pool. I'm having another hibiscus marg. I just want to say that this is like the best drink in the entire world. Like if I could drink this every drink ever. You guys, we saw a whale. I, I think that's boat. the boat. Okay, oh there, God. there, there. Did you get it? Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm coming alive again. <laughs> I'm defrosting. I'm wearing this cute little like kimono robe thing from Risa and I'm obsessed with it. It's like, I am obviously just wearing a robe but it makes me feel like chic and cute and put together. And I kind of feel like I need to like take a photo in this chair. But we're just defrosting out on our little patio before we get ready for dinner. There's Panda. I just ordered some mango and tahini and it's like the best freshest mango I've ever had in my whole life and mango is like my favorite fruit so I'm a happy girl. My mouth is full but we're, we're ready for dinner. We're in our outfits that we changed into last night. Yeah. Because we're comfy and we didn't get photos in them. These silky pants I love them so much. They're from Donnie. So is this top and they're just like so comfy and good and then this is vitamin A swim. Amanda? Take it away. <laughs> These are Farm Rio. I love them because they're perfect for Mexico. It's like all the vibes. This is vitamin A and I've literally had it for- Wait, we're both wearing a vitamin A thing. Oh, really? Yeah. I've had this for literally they... five years. Yeah, I like that they don't like shrink. Yeah, I honestly, I've gotten the best use out of this than any other shirt I have. This is Michelle's. It's R-U-M-I. Okay, that's all. Amanda and I are at dinner. She just got bit by a mosquito on her foot. I got bit on my ear. And we're freaking out. They love both of our blood. We are literally the most paranoid people here. So we're here. sitting here. I'll like, go check our check our outfits now. <laughs> no, we're buttoned up to our necks. We just sprayed this like bug repellent. It's like natural though. All They're over. Like waitress. And we are sitting on our feet like the least sophisticated humans. Like we're literally our feet are underneath us like we're four years old because we're scared of putting them under the table. I already got bit on my foot. I refuse to get another one. I'm so paranoid right now. We are drinking tea in bed again post dinner and so basically every night we order chamomile and mint tea like two pots of tea and every night Amanda has been like Michelle I don't think that these teas are different like they taste exactly the same and every night I'm just like okay I don't know I don't know I don't know no I fully go crazy like and I try both of them and then I make her try it and yeah. then I like yeah it's a whole so thing. then when she ordered tonight she was like do you, are you giving us chamomile and mint tea? Like, cause they taste the same to us. And the lady was like, I'll ask, like, let me figure it out. Maybe we need to add more mint. They come, they drop off the teas. And we were like, so which one's chamomile and which one's mint? And he was like, they're both chamomile and mint. <laughs> also, we had chamomile ice cream at dinner and it was on fucking real and last night they left us chamomile cookies unreal i think that's my new favorite thing good night night hello good morning we just did our morning routine we got coffee at the coffee cart we went and did a workout 
changed into bikinis and now I will show you what I'm wearing. It's something I don't usually wear, but I really like it. <laughs> A -N Archie or Anchi? A-N-C-H-I-E. Okay, I'll link it for you guys, but let me show you first. Anchi swim, if it would freaking focus. Good for the small boobies. Here's the bottoms. And then I'm wearing these little shorts that are from Stone Fox Swim. It's our last full day. And Amanda is wearing, what is it, bare minimal? Mm-hmm. Load, focus. Okay, well, she's blurry, but she's cute. <laughs> Little beach girl. Guys, this sunscreen, it smells so good. And it's reef safe, and it sprays nicely. Oh my God, our coconut. Day three. We just got our massages. <laughs> and they French braided our hair at the end. I what like, do you think? Literally, look at samurai. <laughs> I could not believe. I was so confused. When she started doing it, I, we both, like, we were in separate rooms, but we were like, what the fuck are they doing? The whole time I was like, I need to text Michelle. <laughs> To see if she's getting one too. I thought maybe it was just my girl who was like, oh, let me just no braid same. your hair. I was like, I can't wait to tell you that my girl braided my hair. <laughs> Listen to this. We just ordered room service mm -hmm. and then we asked for our favorite desserts so there's two restaurants here that we ate at the last two nights and we liked one dessert from each of them the banana bread and the corn cake and that's what we're doing for dinner it's tonight. our last night so yolo you know we're psychos the way i asked for it was hilarious i couldn't name remember the name of the restaurant and i was like <laughs> can we get the corn cake from the restaurant on the left and, and the, banana the banana bread from the right? restaurant on the right <laughs> anyways we're excited we already ate our dinner but like Look at that, corn cake, ice cream, banana bread. Mm. Good morning. Mandy Pandy is sick. I have a sinus infection. It's our last morning. We're gonna go get some coffee. We're gonna get that pastry we've been dreaming about and some juice and some more mango and sit in the sun for a bit. I will show you my kini from a brand called Janthi. I wore it in Italy. So if you were watching my Tuscany Italy vlog, then you will remember it. There she is. It's actually really cute. We're gonna go soak up our last couple hours. One final coconut, one final hibiscus marg over here. I'm not gonna try and pick it up. I don't even know if you can see it. I have a spicy tuna roll on the way, and we're literally soaking up our last hour. I am baking so I can go home with a tan because it literally snowed in LA yesterday and hailed, and it snowed in Arizona. Like, are we okay? Is the world ending? It is. Meanwhile, here we are. Meanwhile. Hi, fam. I just got home back in LA, as you can see, and showered. It's like 7 p.m. I'm about to go run to the grocery store. I don't think I mentioned this, but basically that was like my last hurrah and tomorrow I am starting a 21 day detox because I have a couple health things going on. Um, I did blood work recently and I found out I have heavy metal poisoning and then also some candida overgrowth in my gut. So I'm starting a detox tomorrow to help with all of that and it's like super strict on what I can eat and it's basically like, no carbs, no sugar, no nuts, no alcohol. I think that's the majority of it, but basically it's like a lot of like 
protein and veggies and fruits obviously um and nothing fun and so i'm doing that for the next three weeks right in between this trip and another trip that i have so i have to start first thing tomorrow so that i have enough time to do with the three weeks so basically i just got home and i'm like mm, what do i have for dinner because it's gonna be like my last chance to eat carbs which as you all know my favorite food but i just wanted to end the vlog here and say thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i will probably talk to you very soon